Hey guys, welcome back. Happy Sunday. It is Sunday evening. I hope you guys have had a good weekend. Um, I guess it's like the first week back where it's like a full week, right? I'm sorry if you can hear my dishwasher. Um, it's loud. Anyway, so I, yesterday I kind of just went all over town and I thought that, you know, since I've been everywhere, I would go to Walmart because the last time I got Walmart wax was probably like at the very end of winter, I'm gonna say. And I needed to kind of like stock back up on some scents because I've melted through most of them, honestly. Plus there was a couple of scents that I wanted to try and see how they were. But before I show you the Walmart wax, I wanna show you guys some candles. So this one I picked up last weekend. It was before the semi-annual sale from Bath & Body Works. This is bergamot and birch. The notes say vibrant bergamot. I always put an N before the T, bergamot, black amber and birch wood. It's like trying to be masculine, but to me it's just a very fresh, scent it's just happy to me it's a happy fresh scent so yeah i have been on a fresh like spree i have really becoming prone to fresh scents so kind of story time i guess so at my previous house and really everywhere else that i've lived i've devoted um you know like one day a week to clean and like as you get closer to your cleaning day like your house gets messier I mean that's how it is with me and so because I'm lazy sometimes and I don't I don't clean up well I would devote that day to melting a nice clean scent and put it throughout my whole house and I started noticing how relaxing it is like fresh scents are like just as relaxing as like a lavender blend like laundry I'm all about um and just fresh that includes floral green aquatic scents like right now i have amazon rain going in my entire open concept and i just cleaned and it just it smells amazing in here i mean it's like heaven so i've started to really warm a lot of fresh scents and i'm just all about it okay i don't know why i felt the need to tell you that but that's i guess that's the majority of what's in here is a lot of fresh um so I've never tried peach bellini, you guys. Like, where have I been? Succulent white peach, sparkling prosecco, and sweet orange. It's so nice. Oh, it's just, yeah, it's a nice peachy, happy scent. So um, I don't really love the packaging on that, but that's okay. And I've just been wanting to try this. I haven't heard the best of reviews on the iced lemon pound cake. If you guys like this, let me know, I'm curious. Um, so it's sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake. I mean, it's amazing on cold. It's definitely like a buttery lemon-like cake scent. It's really good, so anyway. Those are the candles I picked up onto the Walmart wax. So I only picked up one scent from the mainstays, you know, whatever. This is strawberry waffle cone. So I don't know how much, cause I haven't warmed one of these clams in my open concept. I have a feeling like maybe one would be enough. I mean, these are only one and a quarter ounce, but you know, whatever. So this is good. I get where they're going with the waffle cone. You know, at first I thought this smelled like chapstick, but it's actually not as bad as I thought. <laughs> but I wanted to try it because I've been seeing it and I've been hearing and seeing people haul it and stuff. So I was like, we're gonna try it. Okay, so I got, I actually, I, I took one of their things, but here's all the clams I got, plus one, so. That goes for Sensationals and Better Homes and Gardens. So the first one I have here is Sea Salt Lavender. I've never had this before and it sounds amazing. It says breathe in and breathe out. This is a part of the floral family and this is so good. 
So on the top, I feel like I detect masculine. And then I get a nice fresh lavender. It's like almost leaning spa-like, but it's not quite there. But it's still really good. So I'm excited about that. Okay, the next one is Maui Driftwood. Never had this one either. And this is a part of the wood family. This is really nice. Um, this is so good. This is like a salty shore, like a salted sandy shore. You definitely get the sand. To me, I get sand. Like a salted sandy shore with a little bit of coconut. To me, coconut is not super like dominant in here and neither is the amber to be honest. Oh, this is so good. Like this gives me like beach vibes, but in a really good way, you know, like realistic. So I, they did good on that one. By the way, I don't know if it was the Sensationals or the Better Homes and Gardens went up to $2.48 a clam. So that's, you know, it's still cheap, but I mean, damn, like everything keeps going up. Like Am I gonna have to move out on the street? Literally. Um, Better Homes and Gardens, uh, Apple Blossom, and Freesia. So this is Apple Blossom, Freesia Greens, Pear, Raspberry, Sugared Currant, and Apricot. So I remember like sm after smelling all of these, I thought this one was definitely on the sweeter end of floral. Like you definitely, like I don't get raspberry really or apricot, I do get pear. It's just a really nice sweet floral, but it very fresh too, it's really pretty. I'm, I'm excited to try that one, never have. Hawaiian Blossom, um, Sweet Pomelo and Sunkissed Tear, I don't know what that is. And of course this is floral. Yeah, when it says sun-kissed, they're not lying. It is like a sun-kissed floral. I don't know how to explain sun-kissed other than it's like, like a golden scent. Like it has, it has warmth, I would say. It's like a warm, a warm floral, beachy floral. This one's also really pretty. I'm gonna end up like saying they all smell pretty and fresh and floral, but I mean, it's true. They do. You have to just smell them to differentiate, you know, how different they are from each other, in my opinion. Okay, Better Homes and Gardens. <laughs> I got this actually, because Carrie talked about it. It's Honeysuckle Glow. This is Evening Rain, Davana, Davana, <laughs> Fruity Jasmine, Firefly Honeysuckle, Rose Jasmine, Earthy Patchouli, and White Birch. This is so nice. Um, it's not like punch you in the face, like knock you out, you know, floral. It's a nice, like, how do I, I don't even know. I mean, it is honeysuckle, but it's not too sweet at all to me. It's very, I don't know, what is it? Oh, it's just, it's really good. I get the green note in here too. I really like this. This is really pretty. Okay, French lilac flowers or French lilac and flowers. Lilac, pear, boxwood, violet, and berries. Definitely lilac. And I like lilac. It's very nice. It's To me, it's a really good spring scent. To me, like floral scents are gonna be great or w are great when it's like a rainy day. I don't know, it just kind of gives you like, it's definitely summer vibes in my opinion, I don't know. But that one's also very pretty. It's a little sweet, not much at all. Okay, <laughs> wildflower dreams. Uh, let your imagination blossom, that is not a scent note. Um, we have floral, duh. This is more of a fresh to me than it is a floral. 
but somebody might say the complete opposite. It's very fresh. It's definitely a fresh scent. But you, it's like you get wafts or whiffs of it, of the floral note. Mm, yeah, it's really pretty. This is really, really pretty too. This is definitely like more up my alley based on the other florals in here, which is like all of them. So it's just pretty. It's soft, fresh. Y'all know what I mean. Okay, fresh, <laughs> fresh daisy and lemon. Like where, who am I? But I, I really, I mean, I do like, I've always liked fresh and floral. I don't know. Okay. No. Whoa. See, this is what I mean. We go away, please. I don't have time for that. <sighs> Definitely get the lemon. And to me, it's almost lemon forward, but lemon is a like a strong scent in blends. I mean, you generally get that first, and I do too. It's like to me, this is like a beautifully cleaned kitchen. <laughs> It's just, it's fresh, it's a little sweet, it's a little floral, but it's definitely lemon. It's really pretty. Okay, this I've had before, and it's been a while. I know this is a favorite from Canada Kim, and I think Carrie likes this one too. I mean, a lot of people like this scent. It's Better Homes and Gardens Lavender and Lemonade. I mean, it's kind of a staple scent for me. It's not one that I hoard or that I need all the time, but it's, it's nice. It's lemon sugar, pineapple water, lavender, melon, and vanilla. And it, to me, it's like a happy, it, it really is, it's lemonade with like lavender in it. But it's very fresh, it's a little, it's not like quite citrus, but it's like, you know how lemonade smells. But it's a bright, very bright scent. Mm. It's really good. This is really nice. And these Better Homes and Gardens, you guys, are sensational for that matter. I'll put like three cubes in my open concept and I'm good. Like there's a lot of throwing power in those. Okay, Kitchen Herb. I feel like I'm missing one. Never mind. Purple Basil. Fennel, wild lavender, sage leaf, mint, and chamomile. This is definitely herby. So if you don't like herb scents, you wouldn't like this. But to me, it's like earthy. When I say it's herby, it's earthy. I get the basil and I get the sage. But I don't really love sage, but I like this. This is really nice too. I'm excited to warm that. Another great, amazing, fresh scent. What do you know? We have another fresh scent, and this is the last one. Warm Spring Sunshine. This is white peach, daisy, granny smith, apple, rainwater, melon, garden florals, and amber. I remember I've smelled this at one point, but I don't, I didn't remember it. And this is so good, you guys. This is like I'm outside at a picnic table and I brought fruit. Like I'm at a picnic and the and the you know, but you you didn't bring sandwiches. You brought fruit, like fresh fruit. So you get like this nice, like very fresh air kind of scent. With the, you know, peach, I definitely get. It's really pretty. I like this a lot. Um, I'm really excited about this too. Another amazing fresh scent, but it is a more fruitier fresh. So that's it. Thank you guys so much for coming in and taking some time with me. Um, I do enjoy stocking up on some Walmart wax. I don't go as crazy as I used to only because like, I used to go crazy, but that was like pretty much all I warmed was Walmart wax. And since getting into vendor wax, you know, I like to kind of spread it out. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend, a good week ahead, and I will see you in my next one. Take care. Bye, guys.